This is the energy vibration reading for for the um uh, for the Aries. Okay, this is the seventeenth week, and this is the last week of April. The weeks begin from the twenty third until the twenty nine, and this is going to be wonderful. So not to worry. Um. The week is a wheel of fortune, so it's a fire, it's a fire week, and the zodiac energy is earth. So, for you, Aries is going to be extremely um, good. Okay, so it's the week of positive energies. Um, let's see what's happening on Monday. Um, we have the energy of the four of sword. The energy of the four of sword is a wonderful energy. It's an energy where um, the whole of last week was a busy week and the weekend and now you're taking some rest okay taking some rest is just being with yourself basically it's just you connecting with yourself and you know um, closing off the rest of the world and just come uh, you know taking in a peace it's a day of inner peace then we have the energy of the Queen of Cups okay who is this queen of cup who is this person what is her situation and why is she here some people could be taking on the energy of the queen of cups of being very nurturing and very loving and um, giving out a lot of um, love and positive energies so let's see what is happening on Wednesday on Wednesday we have the energy of the princess of cups so um, I should say because this is a new deck this is the or wisdom see Kataric and this is a new deck and this has been coming up where the fire signs was for I think it was the air the the air the air sign people and now we have the cups people for the fire people so obviously um, there is a sort of a um, um, karmatic situation because it's a week of the wheel of fortune so there is basically karmatic situations that is um, taking um, place okay Let's look in Thursday. Um, the um, crowning of the week, you have the Five of Pentacles in reverse, which is um, very, very positive. Okay, let's look at Friday and the weekend and see what is coming up for you, Aries. We have the Three of Pentacles. So on Friday, um, there is going to be a situation that you, Aries, are working together with a Queen of Cups. So on Friday, um, you could be visiting the Queen of Cups, or the Queen of Cups could be visiting you. This could be your mom. This could be your sister. This could be a family member that you're very close with. That sort of an energy, but obviously there is a situation that is going. Then you have the energy of the Five of Cups, a sort of a regret, and this regret it has to do with the Queen of Cups and the Princess of Cups. So, um. We're not sure what is transpiring. This could be um, a situation with your sisters um, that there you're having a regret about the situations that you, you know, it could be that there is a situation that is happening in the family and two sisters are connecting on a high level and you feel and you're feeling basically left out on Saturday. And on Sunday, um, we have the energy of. Uh, um, the hermit the energy of the hermit keeps on coming up in this week for a lot of signs um, it is a time that people are going to start looking at themselves because of certain situation and dynamic that is changing and this is basically what is happening in this week especially on Sunday you're going to be start thinking about you know uh, have I done the right thing and this sort of a thing it's it's, it's, it's a situation where, where it has to do with um, for some of you is your sister for some of you as a friend for some of you is a, a, a sister-in-law or a daughter-in-law or an adopted daughter or that sort of a thing so a lot of you fire signs will be working with um, a lot of you fire signs will be working with the energy of the water sign your energy in this week is the eight of cups uh, the seven of cups um, there you're thinking uh, of more opportunities you're thinking of um, opening more doors you're thinking of uh, being present um, and bringing in something different in whatever the situation is okay so um, this is a week of a lot of trends uh, transfer uh, transfer 
transformation that is going to be happening and a lot of um, a family dynamic that is going to be happening because I'm seeing um, regrets that you Aries are having some regrets it could be a haunt or two aunt or a friend and you're feeling left out you're feeling as if um, you don't have the money to be with these people or you're you're looking within yourself with a situation so let's see exactly what is happening so on Monday um, and 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 I should say because this actually because this is nine and this is three this is five I should say it's a week of emotional healing it's a karmatic situation from the past and you're hoping and wishing that you can connect also with other people okay so with the energy of the four of swords and the queen of cups you have the three of cups in reverse okay so obviously um, whatever meeting that you have with this person it's not going to be a celebration it's going to be sadness um, it's going to be sadness um, it's as if um, there is a, a, a debt in the family or there is something that has happened in the family and here it's, it's, it's a meeting but it's not a meeting of celebration it's a meeting of um, a sadness okay whatever that is transpiring is a meeting of sadness so um, you're taking you know you're wishing that you could connect more with the screen of cups but um, it could be that you're trying but it's not happening because for some reason there's information that will be coming at you from the screen of cups it's as if she's saying you know you have just done, done something wrong you shouldn't have done that sort of a thing and um, she is really um, you know um, being honest with you with a situation and some people will um, uh, you know it's, it's, it's as if conflicts that is coming up between this could be a sister or a mother or a daughter or a adopted daughter or a sister-in-law or that sort of a thing but this person is not really um, completely she's she's speaking to you from the heart of a situation that you have done and um, obviously um, there is a situation in the family that has transpired and she's seen it and it doesn't have to be in the family it can be between friends because this is more of a situation that is someone who is uh, much older than you over the age of 40 and you know she's speaking to you about something and it could be that you have your own way and she's you know saying you know sometimes maybe it's better if you listen to people or you do something different let's see what's happening with the Queen of Cups and the Princess of Cups this is a positive connection because what is happening this I am feeling the dynamics that this situation has to do with sisters civilian that you are feeling left out because there is it could be your mom and your sister that is very close and this is a very dynamic relationship where you have become a bit jealous because you feel a bit left out okay and they are really connecting on a high energy level and you're feeling a little bit left out in the cold and I think um, it could also be um, that you or you have uh, two other friends that are a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and they are much more connecting than um, and you are feeling left out in the cold some of you could have this situation at work and some of you could have the situation with you trying to balance out and build a strong foundation okay and this situation is a very very this is a sort of situation that is happening because you're having some regret whatever the situation is you are basically having some regret because um, it's as if you feel as if you know um, I could have been um, better at whatever I could have connected better with these people okay and it has to do with a situation that has to do with work for some people but for some people it's a family situation that either your mom and your sister is connecting a younger sister or older sister is connecting and you're feeling a little bit left out and you're seeing that they're having this beautiful relationship some of you have to deal with this could be um, your husband um, this for the men could be that you know you're connecting um, your wife 
and daughter from another a marriage is not really connecting and uh, or they're connecting and you feel left out because you weren't oh um, um, you know it's as if it's surprising that they're connecting so good together as we look um, there's good news that is going to be coming in um, from the princess of, of cups for your financial situation so um, expect news coming in from the princess of cup about your financial situation okay so that is a good news between Wednesday and Thursday you will receive message from the um, Queen the Princess of Cups um, a message about um, money coming in and this is uh, and, and this is going to be good or extra work this is going to be um, very positive then we have the energy of the um, the Knight of Wands and remember that the this is not the night the page of ones the page of ones is always a new start okay so a, um, a new start is going to be coming in for you uh, where it comes to work and this is going to be good some of you are sitting down wondering when is this going to be happening because I need to balance out my financial situation okay in the weekend um, Friday is a day where you be working together it doesn't really matter it's as if there is an a transformation it could be a death in the family it could be a change that comes in the family and you and your sister or you and your mom uh, seems to be coming to a place um, or it could be you and your grandma that is seems to be connecting to a place to kind of resolve or make something work okay the seven of ones is that you're trying to protect yourself from whatever the situation is and whatever um, the person is saying to you because obviously it is as if um, it was a situation would work and you're trying to protect yourself or some of you may be working with someone that is coming at you um, with harsh words or negative energy and that sort of a thing and you're trying to really protect yourself from this okay in the weekend you have some regrets in the weekend and you you're um, sitting down thinking about it and these regret has to do with one with work and two with a message but um, the thing about it is that um, I think that some of you want time off or some of you need to get away for a, some situation and you want to be there for someone but you're unable to do so and you feel as if you're not doing your best okay in any case money is coming and this is good because at the end of the week so in the weekend some extra money will be coming into you um, because um, you're seeing this transpire um, because the message of uh, good news is on its way um, came in on Wednesday um, Wednesday Thursday for some people so it could be the end um, Wednesday even it could be Thursday morning that this good news is basically coming in and um, there is news that is coming in to you um, that money some extra money money that you weren't aware of that was available um, is going to be coming in um, financial help is basically going to be coming in and this is going to be good okay so what I'm seeing here in the dynamics that is here in this week is as if um, you're feeling left out you're feeling as if your mom and your siblings or there are two women at your work that is very close and you're feeling left out because basically um, it's a situation where um, it's as if you want to do more but you can't do more because you're financially not um, stay but to do more but not to worry um, because uh, on um, Wednesday Thursday news will be coming in good news will be coming in and um, you are going to be receiving um, money coming into you so um, this is going to be good um, some of you men maybe um, there is going to be a victory over you because um, um, the chariot is behind you so that means uh, um, someone if you had a situation 
um, someone is going to be victorious over you because the chariot is behind you if the chariot was before you is that you were going and you are going to be having victory but the chariot is behind you that means someone has victorious over you okay so for you men over the age of 40 whatever that has been happening in your life whatever it has been transpiring in your life um, there seems to be a victory that is over you and you need to pay um, pay out some money whatever this was um, the news is going to be coming um, from a woman who's gonna say you know you need to pay it could be also that you have um, lost um, um, uh, you have lost a case and you have to pay some child support or you have to pay um, some money um, um, uh, some money with taxes and that sort of a thing um, and this is showing up here if you have in, in this week it's going to be a week of meditation meditation will bring answers to whatever the situation that is happening for you guys in this week because obviously um, there's a, a lot of situations that is happening um, the energy of the number four is here and, and the energy of the number four is always that um, you're building a strong foundation whatever it is transpiring you're trying to build a strong foundation in relationship in your family life and it's and in business but it's more there is um, it's like a karmatic healing that is coming in in this week okay I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back please like share thumbs up these videos and namaste until next week Thank you.